variety -o. so hey guys and welcome back to another video my name is of course Jake now that was such an over exaggerated intro I'm gonna have a bit of talk to you guys tonight the time is now 1030 and it is a what is today today is Tuesday it's something that I've sort of been thinking about for like the last couple of weeks or so and I'm gonna talk to you guys about it okay well just briefly a way to put it is I think a lot of people are thinking the way I do my videos why do I keep doing them when I don't get a big audience with a lot of views and why I don't have a lot of subscribers okay well yes I don't get a lot of views and I don't have a lot of subscribers and it's not really a big audience and the reason I keep doing these videos and I keep having a really bright personality and I'm happy and I'm just really excited to make these videos is because that's the way other YouTubers are, that's the way other vloggers are and I try and take that on board with me. Yes, I know, I sort of act like I've got a big audience and I'm talking to a wider range of people and a bigger audience when I only have 55 subscribers. Yes, I know, a lot of YouTubers and they all say they could be stuck on 50 subscribers for one whole year. And yeah, I've nearly done this YouTube thing for a year. I've done it for about 10 months now and I'm on 55 subscribers. And I'm making these videos as I've got hundreds of subscribers and a bigger audience. The reason I'm doing that is to stay positive and be positive that I'm gonna gain an audience. Like if other successful YouTubers like Casey Neistat and all of those, they can, have 50 subscribers for one year and now they've got millions of subscribers and a massive audience. I'm sure if I've been stuck on 55 subscribers and it's been about 10 months, I'm sure I could head down that road. If I stick to these vlogs and never give up, that's how I do it. I'm gonna stick to these vlogs. But yeah guys, I hope you liked my last vlog. It was a bit of a chilled vlog. I didn't do too much. We just went down and I seen Ben and we went to the tip. We had to try and find some stuff for his drift trike that he's trying to make. This video will probably be a bit chilled. I'm not too sure. I don't know what the world's gonna throw at me and what's gonna happen, but yeah, I'm kinda like not just doing a weekly vlog. Just doing a vlog every now and then, sorta when I'm gonna do a couple of things, or just so I don't have to rely on doing uploading on a Sunday. I can upload whenever I want sort of thing. It's just a little bit better, I think. Let me know what you guys think. That'd be mad. Alright, I just got off the bus from school. I didn't video yesterday because I had to go to work and all that stuff, so there's no point, it's really boring. This afternoon, I'm going over to my Nan and Pops, and do you remember that cabinet thing I made? It was only like a small cabinet, but I'm taking it to my Nan and Pops, and I'm gonna, like, do, I'm gonna, like, oil it and do a really nice finish on it, so I'm gonna do that, and I'm gonna have dinner, and just spend a bit of time with them, so that'd be nice. I actually don't think I've shown you guys my job that I'm about to oil. I know before I just said I did, but I'll just quickly show you guys what it is. So this is the job here. It's like some doors, all of that, and this is all opened. All that, so it'll look all good. I've oiled the top part a little bit. You can probably see the color difference compared to like that to that. It looks a little bit different, but I'm gonna do the whole thing as I couldn't do that at school. So yeah, that should look really, really good. When I first started this job, all in here, I put like a clear, like varnish sort of thing. Like it's no stain or anything. It's just a clear, like a, just a clear coat, just to seal it sort of thing. So I'm gonna try and rub all that off because when I did this at school, I wasn't allowed to oil it, just except the top. 
But now I'm gonna try and oil the whole thing. So I'm gonna try and rub it all off and get it looking good. This is the oil I'm using. This like Dex oil stuff. I'll zoom that in. That's it just there. It's really good stuff. Like we've done a table just inside and it just comes out really, really nice. So I'm looking forward to seeing the final result of this. I'm gonna time lapse this. Start the time lapse now. Girls, I know it hurts to lose your guy. I just did my first coat on this just of the top and check it out. It looks so nice already. First coat. I'm gonna go to bed now guys it's been a long day for me I'm probably not gonna talk to you guys tomorrow because I'm going to work so there's no real point so I'll talk to you guys on Sunday but until then just keep smiling I've never ever said that but I usually put that right at the end of my videos. I'm gonna sort of have that as my like slogan thing now. So guys, until then, just keep smiling. Awesome. Good morning guys. What a beautiful day it is for Father's Day. Look at this. Beautiful blue skies. I couldn't ask for a better day to go spend it with my pop and my nan, but mainly my pop because it is Father's Day and he is the one who is pretty much like a father to me. The time is now 9.40 and I got up ready because I want to go down there and see them and mum's like, we're not going yet. And I'm like, oh, why? And she's like, oh, I've got to clean up, tidy up and everything. And I'm like, I just want to go. Last night, I watched one of Evan Shanks' videos. If you guys don't know who Evan Shanks is, he's like a car vlogger over in America. And like he does, he does stuff with like TJ Hunt and all these other car vloggers and stuff. And he said this thing in one of his videos and it really, really hit me and went far. What he said was, the progress may be slow, but the progress isn't over. And that means, the progress, yes, it may take a long time and it may be slow, but being slow doesn't mean it's over. And when he said that, I just really thought about it and I thought, that is true. Like, progress doesn't always have to be fast and instant. It can take time. And the way I think about it, the longer it takes, the better it's going to be in the long run. <sighs> it just went really far with me. How do I open this? Oh, here we go. I've never had a car that I don't know how to open. Pin. All right, let's do this. An hour later, and we're finally going. Let's go. Mum's nearly as bad as Miranda when it comes to taking her time. Just get in the car. <laughs> Oh, tell me. Yeah. Oh, all this stuff I'm getting. Huh? What's that ceramic microwave? Oh my goodness. It's got one of them things, look. Huh? Look at that. That's a good That's the one you wanted? Yeah. Oh, I'll use that. Alright, that's great. Sitting down at this water must have to be like one of the nicest spots to just relax. It's so nice down here. But yeah. Pop really liked what we, but what me and Mum both got him for Father's Day. He's pretty much my father, as I don't speak to my actual father. But yeah, I'm not going to go into that. But it's just something I just don't really want to share about. But yeah, he he's my father. I pretty much look up to him as that. But enough of all that. 
let's just enjoy this beautiful scenery. Wow, I've got it. <sighs> There's nothing like coming home and just laying on your bed and be like, <sighs> <laughs> I've just came out and I'm about I'm going for like a ride on my board right and I've kind of I'm kind of thinking about turning around because I've just realized it's September and that's when all like the magpies swoop and yes I am such a girl when it comes to magpie season I don't know something about it's just like a fear of mine, it just really frightens me like getting swooped, I don't know why, it's just It's just a weakness of mine, I absolutely hate it A weakness, is that, is that the right word? I don't know I'm kind of thinking just take the risk and just go But knowing me, being scared, I'll get swooped Normally, I've only ever been, no, actually I've been swooped once, I didn't have a helmet on I was just walking down past like our local police station, I was just near there and I got swooped and it was terrifying. The rest of the times I've been on a bike and I've had like a helmet on but today I haven't seen any magpies around so it's, it's, it's good so far. I just hope I don't get swooped. <laughs> I probably look like the biggest idiot right now. I can't even hear myself because I'm just pumping my music, but I don't know. Who cares? What the hell? My hair's like all. I pretty much went for a ride and I didn't, I didn't really go that far. I just went kind of down the road and then. God, I can hardly hear myself talk this music. There we go. Yeah, I came back just after about half an hour because. I don't know, I didn't want to go too far, just, I don't know, I'm just, it, I'm just, I'm just terrified, I'm just terrified of magpies in September, I just, I just really am, like, it's just, it's something, like, I will admit, but, it's kind of something, I'm a little, little bit embarrassed about it, but I'll, I don't really care, I just thought I'd tell you guys, because it's kind of funny, but, yeah, guys, while I'm out in this nice sunshine, I'm going to finish up this vlog, because, Jesus, no, it's a bit, bit too bright. Bit. But yeah, I'm gonna finish up this vlog pretty much here because tonight I have to do a bit of stuff for school because I've got exams this week. And I just wanna do like a bit of revision, revise and stuff. I've gotta watch a film for an English exam tomorrow. So I wanna have tonight just for that. I just want to do that all tonight. So I'm going to finish up this vlog here. I hope you guys have enjoyed these last couple of days. But yeah guys, make sure to like and subscribe, comment for any future videos, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Later guys.